For me, teaching in a virtual learning environment, no matter what the class, is really about extending presence and building online community. By using platforms like Seismic for threaded video blogging, even through asynchronous communication, you can have a rich experience online. Take this thread, for example, in which a student was asking our guest speaker, Fred Benenson from Creative Commons, a question. I'm actually really glad you're here this week because I have a question uh, for you regarding Creative Commons. Um, it's something that's actually... Hi, Heather. Uh, good question. So, uh, Creative Commons licenses are meant to be really flexible in the attribution respect. Through collaborative online activities like mashups, we can also build rich, layered experiences online. In this example, we used Aviary, an online mashup community with free online image editors that enable you to create visual mashups as well as see the sources from which they came. In this case, the three photographs that make up this visual mashup. What's even better is if you can do mashups in a real-time immersive environment. In this clip, I'm in Second Life, showing students how to combine each other's visual mashups and sound samples and insert them into a sculpted object so that we have a virtual sculpture garden that we can walk through, filled with 3D objects textured with their visual mashups and soundscapes. What it really boils down to is optimizing the emergent platforms and media available to us so that we're not just using them, but creating frameworks that allow us to connect, communicate, and collaborate with each other.